Steve Dotto here. How the heck are you doing this fine day? Me? I'm looking forward to sharing with you the one tool which has become indispensable in my email arsenal. You're wondering what it is, aren't you? I will not keep you in suspense. It's called Boomerang for Gmail, today on Dotto Tech. Overcoming email overload is just a challenge for us all. So much pressure comes into our lives on a daily basis through email. Now, I have created a little mini course called Three Steps to Inbox Zero, where I teach you how to overcome email overload. And one tool that I teach and recommend in that course is called Boomerang. It's available for both Gmail and for Outlook users. I want to show it to you now because it's just such a valuable tool for me. And on the surface, it might not seem super sexy. I mean, email itself isn't all that sexy. But what it does when you really dive in and you start to use it properly, it might have the difference to make a big difference in your lives. So I'm just going to jump over into my Gmail account here and show you a little bit of how Boomerang works. Now, Boomerang uh, is basically, it's, it's really built all around what the name suggests. It's all about returning, having email come back to you when you need. Now that might seem counterintuitive if you're trying to get rid of email, but it's all about being in control of your email. And I will show you. When you first install Boomerang, it will install as a browser extension. And it appears here, in, if you're using it in the browser, it appears here in uh, all of the different uh, settings appear here in the menu. But seldom will you use Boomerang here in it would use this menu. Instead, where you typically will end up using uh, Boomerang is when you're reading emails, responding to emails, and dealing with your team. So I'm just going to pretend that this uh, that this email is uh, something that's uh, that's team based. No, it's from Syed at uh, at Upton Monster. It's a good company. Uh, but let me show you how it ends up working for you. When you go to reply, when you click on the reply window in Gmail, you get these additional options right down here at the very bottom of the screen. This is where we see Boomerang in action. And what it does is it allows us to manage the sending and retrieving of this email in a variety of different ways. The first thing it gives us is this send later option. This is pretty cool and it actually works for you in a couple of ways. First thing it will do is if you are replying to email, say late at night, um, when people first come in in the office in the morning, they have a huge backlog of email. You don't want your email to get lost in that backlog. So you can say, you know what? I want it to be sent to, uh, tomorrow morning at say 10.30 in the morning. So I wanna make sure the person's had a chance to kind of get through their initial backlog of email because this is important. That's one feature that will work for you. If you know people look at their email at a certain time, you can time it to come in when it's gonna catch their attention. The other thing that will, this does is if you are burning the midnight oil and you don't want your team or your client to know that you're available at 11.30 at night or one in the morning when you're actually replying, you can mask when you're actually sending it and have it sent at a more business appropriate time. So it gives you control over your messages two ways there as far as sending email out. That's useful. More useful is the actual Boomerang features that next. This is where you take an email and you are say taking something and sending a responsibility to a coworker. What this will do is this will return this email to your inbox at a certain period of time if that person hasn't opened it, hasn't clicked on it, or regardless. So this allows you to manage the workflow. See, one of the key tenants of overcoming email overload is when an email comes into your inbox, you can do one of five things. You can reply to it, you can trash it, you can archive it, you can, um, uh, you can defer it, or you can send it off to somebody else to work on. You can delegate it. If you delegate a responsibility that comes into your inbox. You want to know that it's being executed, that the person has taken care of it. This gives you the ability to delegate effectively because if that person has not opened the email, you know that it's still waiting to be dealt with. So when it returns to your inbox, you say, hey, they haven't opened it yet. I better get on this myself. Or if they haven't replied to you and let you know what, what they're doing with it, then you can also jump on them and say, hey, get let's get going. Let's make sure this is taken care of. So this is a great way for you to defer responsibilities and still maintain control over the process. I like that feature a lot. The other thing that it, uh, when we look at that list, the other thing that Boomerang really serves well is the deferring uh, the deferring the uh, email 
to another time. So for example, an email comes into your inbox and you don't have all the details. You're waiting for some pricing to come in before you make a quote or something like that. So what happens is it sits there in the inbox and it haunts you because every time you open your inbox, you can't do anything about it because that email is sitting there and it's driving you crazy. Well, instead of having that happen, what you can do is you can say, you know what, send this out, but return it to my inbox in a day or in two days when I know I have the other information. This way it's not clogging up your email inbox, it's not taking, it's not adding pressure to you by this thing that which is which has been left there, but it will be dealt with because it's gonna to return to your inbox at the appropriate time. All of this cleans up your workflow and basically reduces the amount of stress that you feel. We talk about this a lot in Three Steps to Inbox Zero, is finding ways to reduce stress in our lives through our email. Boomerang is a big stress reduction tool. These features of being able to defer uh, email to come back into our inbox later, meaning that we don't see it all the time, and to delegate email but have people ha have us uh, have uh, us know when people have responded to or replied to an email and if they haven't, that gives us control and it removes the amount of stress that we're going to feel from a lot of these different tasks. That's the biggest reasons that Boomerang has become a core product for me. Now if you take a look, it's, as I say, it's available for both uh, Gmail and for Outlook. Um, it is a paid product. They do have a free model. If you go into the pricing model here, uh, with you can try it out for free. You can have, uh, uh, you can get a really good idea of how well it's going to work for you in the free version. Personally, I use the pro version, uh, but it, it's going to, I think even the, just the free version, you're going to find Boomerang is a welcome addition to your email arsenal. I hope you found today's video to be useful. Now there are two favors that I need to ask of you. First is please subscribe to this YouTube channel and secondly, please subscribe to our newsletter. That way I can let you know about all of our upcoming events, tutorials and trainings like our Three Steps to Inbox Zero tutorial which we just released. Till next time, I'm Steve Dotto. Have fun storming a castle. <laughs>